Hi and welcome to this tutorial on the new node alignment features introduced inside of Markets and Spec 5R5. The node alignment features allow you to clean up your graph by snapping nodes to each other. Node alignment features are only available if you're using Mari 4.7 or above with this 6 inch back version. So let's take a look first at some basic features and then we move on to some more advanced usages. I'm going to use a material template from the shelf to demo this. And if all I want to do is align some nodes, I'm just going to select those, right mouse click and go to the alignment submenu. In here we have the different alignment options such as align nodes left, right, top and bottom. And you can also see they have convenience hotkeys assigned to them, such as control alt left, right, up and down. I'm going to align nodes to the top and now all nodes snap to the topmost position of your selection. This works also really nicely with the new selection features inside of Mario 4.7. So if you right mouse click, you can see under the selection menus, we have a whole bunch of ways to select nodes. They're also hotkeys. So here, for example, I'm just selecting this, this node, holding down shift and pressing the left arrow key. And now I'm selecting nodes. And now control alt bottom to align nodes at the most bottom part. And now everything is nice and straight. If I'm selecting a backdrop, even if other nodes are selected, the tools will automatically assume that you want to align backdrops with each other. So now if I do control alt right, you can see my color backdrop aligns at the furthest right position to the roughness backdrop. If I do control alt left, it'll snap to the furthest left position. The alignment tools also work with single node selections. If I'm executing alignments with a single node selected, it will step through the positions of the connected input and output. There is some special behavior that in these cases, they will also align with the ports. So here, for example, I have a dot node, and if I execute Control alt and up, you can see we're aligning perfectly with the port that this node is connected to. If I execute now again, we're going to step one step higher, which is the top of the node. So you can see now this is aligned with the top of the node. If I now execute it again, we're going to align with the port of the channel node. And again, then we are aligned with the top of the channel node. This also works obviously with the different port modes. So here, for example, I have a collapse node. So now I'm going to straight align to the top of the node. And then continue further with the other parts. So this is a quick way to just align a node. So if you create a new one, you can just easily align these nodes with each other. 